So I'm never really quite sure why I do this in front of the window, especially because in Seattle there's there's never really any sunlight to, to grab for these videos, and I have blinds closed anyway. Um, but this is January's Japan crate. I only got it a couple days late, and um, notice here, dude. This thing is so overpacked. The top is is bulging. They did send out an email saying some stuff that they had been planning on sticking in here was uh, damaged. Yeah, it got like some water damage or stuff. Apparently, like the dock workers in LA or wherever <sighs> caused all kinds of problems. They did not blame them. I'm just extrapolating because of the dock workers strike and uh, just very other various other stuff. Apparently, in February, there's also going to be a delay and stuff. But, uh, so January 2016, um, Japanese sushito? No, keshito. Oh, no, kureto. Okay. Sorry. Uh, katakana, I'm not quite so immediately literate in. Oh, a premium membership for 30 free days at Crunchyroll. I actually already subscribed to this stuff. Um, yeah. Uh, Himoto Umaru-chan, I would not say, is a very food-themed anime. It's kind of slice of life, kind of. There's this annoying main character that we have to suffer through because everyone else in the series is interesting. But anyway, um, I haven't actually watched uh, Yake, uh, Yaketate Japan, um, and I've only seen the first episode of Food Wars. And, and it really wasn't my cup of tea. Uh, Himoto Yamaru-chan, the character herself, I, I detest. I cannot stand her. Um, every, basically, everyone else in the series is awesome. From her downstairs neighbor to, to the, uh, the foreigner chick. Um, like, everyone is great. Her brother is really cool. Okay, so these, I don't know what these are. These are chocolate-covered things. Um, actually, if, if you have like a Wajimaya or, oh god, I can't think, uh, a Daiso Japan, you can probably find something similar to these around. Um, big ass bag of potato chips. And this is what was causing the bulge. Let's see what's this. Little teddy bear set. Uh, kitchen. Some kind of kitchen set. Let's look and see what's inside the kitchen set. Um, a shelf and, like, this is a jar, some stuff probably to put on the shelf, some flowers. This is not impressive. At all. <clears throat> At all. At all. But whatever. These off-time little tchotchkes in here that are that are whatever they are. Now, what else have we got? We've got <clears throat> a pen. And the reason why I note the pen, is this a pen? Maybe this is a pen. Yes, this is a pen. Um, is because I got a comment in my last YouTube video saying he'd already gotten his, uh, and what he got as a replacement was just a pen. Um, and I'm sorry to say that in the premium crate, uh, you also get a, a pen. Uh, yay. Uh, more, more Pocky. Uh, some type of orange fizzy drink. Is this orange fizzy drink? No, this is, uh, orange gummies. Um, I'm reluctant to try any of these because I just brushed my teeth. Uh, some kind of freaking chewy stuff. It's probably soy flavored. Let's go ahead and try this soy flavored chewy thing. Oh, they look rather different than what's on the front. These look opaque. These are less so. And, um... These gummies are pretty... Uh, chewy. There is a little gush in the center as you break through to it. Very non... Um, non-descript. Beyond that. I 
candles. <clears throat> light, nice little puff of thing. Those look like sweet tarts. They do not smell like sweet tarts. What do they smell like? They, uh, they smell really good. Hmm. Yeah, they're crunchy and tart and vaguely strawberry. You need strawberries and cream. These are tasty. Drink thing, lemon sea. I want to say we've gotten lemon sea before. Hmm. They're not bad. Or maybe I've just had lemon sea before. Some kind of Pikachu, pineapple, Pokemon thing. Uh, Pocky pretzel. Uh, Hello Kitty Pocky. Uh, some kind of Starburst lemon, Starburst lemon thing. Where's Waldo gum? Yes, I think, yes, gum. And some kind of mango candies. Huh. Okay, well, um, the pen is underwhelming. The, uh, this thing was was horribly underwhelming. I, I don't really know what to say to that. I think even the the egg things were more interesting. A big ass thing of potato chips. Surprisingly, no corn this time. I I was kind of taking a bit of back, even if I didn't say anything. Um. That that's not stacking well, and and a pen. So now, weirdly, this premium membership advertisement uh, is kind of lame because anyone could get this. So this is basically just an advert, and and I don't know. I mean, it's good advertising for Crunchy Roll, I think. But I think maybe if they'd included like a, a week premium code for free, that would be much better because I suspect that a lot of people that get Japan Crate that are interested in anime already have a subscription or have already tried the free month at Crunchyroll. So if they'd included a week code where you just get a week of premium for free and you can binge whatever you want, uh, that would have been far cooler. I have never actually read any of these manga. I've just flipped through them and... Uh, and that's it. So let's see if we can figure out what we didn't get. Um, this is not in here. This is what was what was damaged. Page sixteen. So where's this thing? Um, we pulled. They pulled out the pudding. Do it yourself thing. And and so we we got a pen. You will also be getting. A special bonus item in all February Japan crates. It was a thank you for your patience for this month's delay. Okay. Um, well, that's cool. If the pen was just like that was it, that'd be kind of freaking lame. But considering we're going to be getting the pen and, and stuff next month, uh, that's not bad. GABA-infused stress-relieving milk chocolate. GABA is an amino acid that relieves stuff. Okay, so this is not what you get there. I thought this was uh, chocolate wrapped around a little crunchy thing. Um, well, that's not cool. Not too bad. Yam white chocolates? This is white chocolate? No freaking way. No freaking way. All-purpose nail clippers. This is... White? No way. This, this is yam white chocolate. Holy cow. Um, and, um, very different to my American palate. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's maybe a little, a little gross. Wow. Interesting, but gross.